Federal. On court, it broke sharp. There's Tony Marie, an early bid by our shenanigan, and shellacking is right there too as they buy early. It's Mo Breezy moving through with the white cap, and our shenanigan together out to the stretch with on court it just off their heels as they round the first turn. Then toward the inside is Tony Marie through into fourth. Shellacking is fifth in the black silks, then red to run with Swan House and crowned with grace as they go to the back of the course. These two out in front, it's Uncork it and Mo Breezy. They gallop together toward the half mile pole a neck apart with our shenanigan. Well spotted by Axel Concepcion tracking them from third. Shellacking is out deep on the course with Tony Marie in the red cap, saving ground with the rail at 24 feet and bred to run in tight quarters between horses. Then crowned with grace and on the outside of her Swan House, they're a joint last in the Maiden Juvenile Phillies turf, 22.59 lead seconds, past the half mile and 47.05 on Corkett. With the rail for Joseph Belmer, it's on Corkett, who leads them toward the quarter pole from our shenanigan, who's starting her bid as they come toward the top of the stretch and shellacking is raced wide, but is right there. And here's Swan House, who's coming four wide for Luan Machado. Swan House is circling them as they straighten away. Swan House with a swoop, shellacking between horses. Our shenanigan, on Corkett, Levin has dropped back, bred to run, angled out from behind horses. Tony Marie crowned with grace. We trail back to Mo Breezy, who's last. They're well inside the final 16th, and it's Swan House, the daughter of hard spun, Swan House gets the result by four from bread to run. Our shenanigan was third, Shellbacking finished fourth.